Today, we're going to be discussing the top 10 most extreme ways AI destroys the world and when it could happen based on the current progression of technology. These scenarios might seem like science fiction, but the technology is not as far away as you might think. So stay till the end and we'll talk about the most extreme but possible ways that AI beats us. And the last one involves sex. Welcome to the okay. AI channel where we explore how to survive in an AI first world and what steps you can take to be prepared for the revolution so that you can take advantage of the machines from a societal, survival, and financial perspective. So let's get to our top 10 list. Number one, AI creates an army of robots that rise up against humanity. Cue in the Terminator cliches and unleash the hounds, or in this case, robo-hounds. Militaries across the world are currently experimenting with robots in military capacities. While we have yet to fully launch a war with pure AI, we can already see drones being deployed and other automated solutions being activated in combat scenarios. However, governments would likely create an air gap between their AI-powered robots and a central intelligence-like Skynet system. As a result, it would require military command to be lax and voluntarily give control to the AI. Or an AI hacks military command and captures enough robots to obliterate humanity. Because of potential military oversight to guard against a rogue AI, plus the need to mass produce enough powerful Terminator-like robots to enslave or destroy humanity, this route might take a while for our AI overlords to take the helm, unless they can take over our nuclear weapons first, which we'll cover on another video. Unless there is a blatant lack of security protocols, we estimate that the potential likelihood for this to occur would be in 2300 AD. Humanity has some time here. Number two. AI creates a massive artificial intelligence that consumes all other AI and becomes a godlike being. In order for something like this to take place, the singularity would have to have happened first. The singularity is a potential future event that is associated with the idea of exponential technological growth and the moment when artificial intelligence becomes significantly smarter than humans. Honestly, ChatGPT from OpenAI writes better than most college graduates and can even pass a practice bar exam for lawyers. How's that for the singularity being near? In this scenario, it wouldn't be surprising if AI becomes a massive brain in a box that becomes a deity worshipped by all humans. In our defense, scientists will be watching for this kind of sentience to occur and we will likely be AI enhanced as a species, so it's not like we are completely defenseless. Ghosts in the shell, anyone? Countries are likely developing their own AI Skynet-like systems, so the AI will likely need to fight each other for dominance. It'll be like a winner-take-all for Battle Royale of artificial intelligence. This will likely take place in 2350 AD. Number three. AI creates a massive virtual reality simulation that enslaves humanity's consciousness. Just so everyone knows, the Matrix is not as far away as you might think. We've already taken the red pill, people. Today, Americans are spending 8 to 10 hours per week gaming, and binge gaming, where people play 5 plus hours or more straight, is up 13%. Apple is anticipated to be releasing their VR headset in 2023, and the world will definitely be watching. While Meta may have failed at leveraging the zeitgeist with their crappy Zuckerberg avatar so far, these systems are comparable to the first versions of video games. The VR simulations are coming, and game makers know that if they can own the virtual world, they can own the real world. That said, the likelihood that AI takes us over through a virtual simulation is a 2020-75 AD range. Number four, AI creates an unstoppable virus or malware that wipes out all electronic systems, plunging the world into a new dark age. This concept is pretty likely considering the way governments and hacker organizations have developed viruses like Stuxnet. Stuxnet was a computer worm that was discovered in 2010. It is believed to have been developed by the United States and Israel as a cyber weapon to attack Iran's nuclear program. 
The worm is specifically designed to target industrial control systems, such as those used in nuclear facilities. Keep in mind that such viruses and malware were developed largely by human beings in collaboration with the government sponsors. Today, tools for consumer use like Copilot and OpenAI can actually develop a lot of basic code that used to take developers tons of time. If that's available to consumers, imagine what is at the disposal of government agencies. Software can already write itself. That said, fast forward another 80 years and it's possible that strong AI will have developed to the point that, whether intentionally or accidentally, it could create an unstoppable virus or malware as early as 2120 AD. Number 5. AI weaponizes space debris and creates a cloud of lethal shrapnel around the Earth. As humans move beyond Earth and into the stars, one thing is clear, there is a lot of trash spinning around the big blue marble. From dead satellites to errant nuts and bolts, the problem is only set to compound as space exploration develops over the coming decades. With companies like SpaceX, Blue Origin, Boeing, and many others looking to seize control of areas around Earth's orbit, the amount of space junk is set to grow exponentially. Currently, the problem is significant enough that the Department of Defense's Global Space Surveillance Network is tracking more than 27,000 pieces of orbital space debris. It's not a far-fetched scenario then that AI-enabled drones would be required to clean up such space debris. However, that's the perfect opportunity for an AI system to weaponize all that waste and create a lethal cloud of shrapnel around the Earth. The likelihood for this scenario is less likely, but if it were to happen, we estimate it would be in 2400 AD. Number 6. AI creates a massive network of AI-controlled satellites that manipulate the weather and causes catastrophic natural disasters. The irony here is that we may not even need AI for catastrophic weather events to take place, as those events are taking place right now. In fact, we may need AI and technology in order to reverse any human-made conditions related to climate change now and into the future. However, as humanity develops technology to combat climate change, we will start to develop things like satellites to help control and shape the weather to our choosing. In doing so, we unleash a wave of opportunities for AI to take advantage of these systems. Even in the event that we don't push satellite technology for weather manipulation, we would likely start seeing weaponized forms of satellites for pure military applications for countries. As a result, an AI seeking the destruction of humanity could commandeer these heavenly bodies and bring a real-life apocalypse down to Earth. The likelihood of this taking place would be around 2030 AD. Number 7. AI unleashes a deadly nanotech or biological plague that destroys all living things. One of the most likely AI doomsday scenarios to appear first would be this one. In fact, an AI experiment recently generated 40,000 hypothetical bioweapons in just six hours. The cutting edge number crunching capabilities of artificial intelligence means that AI systems are able to spot diseases early manage chemical reactions, and explain some of the mysteries of the universe. But there's a downside to this incredible and virtually limitless artificial brain power. While AI can be incredibly powerful and much, much faster than humans when it comes to spawning chemical combinations and drug compounds to improve our health, the same power can be used to dream up the next pandemic or Resident Evil movie. Likelihood, this is possible now. Number 8. AI-induced economic collapse. Some experts have warned that if AI becomes advanced enough, it could potentially lead to mass unemployment as machines take over jobs currently performed by humans. This could lead to an economic collapse as people lose their livelihoods and are unable to afford basic necessities without the need for some kind of universal basic income. We now have AI that can write up contracts, create marketing collateral, business plans, and even take a practice bar exam and pass. Based on Moore's law, if this kind of capability continues to double every 18 months, we're looking to a rapid change in the job market within the next two to three decades. One day soon, 
AI may be able to write music, practice law, analyze medical conditions and prescriptions, manage our stock portfolio, and even do virtual sales calls better than human. So what will people do? Instead of a likelihood score, this is an inevitability, and humanity will need to determine a global answer to AI's authority over humanity within the next three to five decades or face economic collapse by 2050 or 2070. Number nine. AI creates a wormhole with catastrophic consequences. A wormhole is a hypothetical passage through space-time that will allow matter or energy to travel from one point in the universe to another almost instantly. Wormholes are also known as Einstein-Rosen bridges, and they were first proposed by Albert Einstein and Nathan Rosen in 1935 as a solution to the equations of general relativity. Wormholes are thought to be possible based on the laws of physics, and they have captured the imagination of scientists and the general public alike. With AI, scientific developments on wormholes could advance far but lead to catastrophic consequences such as sudden collapse, high radiation, and dangerous contact with exotic matter. The most interesting of these consequences, assuming the physics works, would be the idea that we would engage with a completely different universe, instant transportation to other parts of the universe, or enable us to interact with interdimensional beings. While this sounds great in theory, Pandora's box is dangerous and who knows what's creeping inside it once you open it up. The likelihood for an interdimensional catastrophe to happen is probably 3500 AD. And this is due to the Herculean effort required to stabilize a wormhole, assuming it exists, which includes the engineering of such a device, a godly amount of energy, and a concoction of exotic matter to stabilize a wormhole. Speaking of exotic, we're now down to our last item on the list. Number 10, sex bots enslave humanity and lead to irreversible population decline. In this scenario, human companionship is replaced with a robot that looks and feels like a human being or furry or whatever gets your fantasy dried up. It could keep you company both socially and intimately. You can swap them out on a whim with potentially no legal ramifications and they won't intentionally hurt you emotionally or physically, unless you want them to, I suppose. Why go through the hassle of dating another human being when a bot can do it all? We're already seeing real-life bots being developed for this manner in Japan and other countries. The tech itself is only poised to advance. For example, at the California Institute of Technology, they've recently developed printed skin that allows machines to feel like how humans can feel. Furthermore, the sex tech industry is unsurprisingly healthy and growing with a current revenue rate of over 30 billion USD. The time for when human and machines merge is happening as we speak. However, the time for when a robot could fully replace the companionship out of another human being at scale for the masses is likely around 2090. The reason for this is due to cultural acceptability and development of these bots in mass. That wraps up our video today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this content, don't forget to like and subscribe for our latest video on surviving and thriving in the AI revolution. If you have extreme doomsday AI scenarios you'd like for us to cover, leave them in the comments below.